Uh, good afternoon. It's uh, Mon Monday. It's Tuesday. Mindset Explosion, episode 14. So, hope you tuned in last night. I'm just trying to get where the light's not so going to be so dazzling you. I'm going to invite some people in and we get started. So, today is about creating your personal brand. brand. <laughs> it's been a long couple of days. It's all good. So, uh, it's got race week in Cheltenham, so it was very busy outside just now. Of all the, a lot of Irish over for the racing, Cheltenham race, Gold Cup week. It's actually good for the town centre. I know not many people like it, it goes crazy, but it is good for uh, Cheltenham as a whole afterwards, of course. All right, so make sure you, uh, if you didn't tune in last night, go to my episode from last night, Monday Mindset, and share that, and you got a chance to win. Uh, feel the fear, do it anyway. Well, I'm going to get started in a minute because my brain is a bit frazzled at the moment. So you have to bear with me today. All right. Thanks for watching. Hi, Sophie. Oh, you're going to love this one. All right. Yes. Hi, Rob. Hi, Lou. Hi, Emma. Who else we got? Hi, Patricia. Donna. Yes. Excellent. Okay. All right. So this is about personal brand. I'm actually going to talk about Facebook Live. So look, we've all got our own brand. We've all got our own personality. We've all got something that we're good at. Excuse the rubber glove. <laughs> uh, we've all got something we, we're good at. We've all got things that we want to talk about and share. And that's your personal brand. So let's say it's race week in Cheltenham at the moment. That's the brand for Cheltenham this week. It's Gold Cup week. You know, we, we know what it's like. And that's, that's the brand. We know what to expect. We see people having fun. We see people doing whatever they're doing. In. But generally, everyone's you know, having fun and you know, betting on horses or whatever it is they're doing, yeah? So that's the brand. But we have our own personal one. And obviously, if you've been following me, my brand is becoming Mindset Explosion. So put some explosion emojis in. So that's my brand. And we all have it. You don't need to have a business, but doing this sort of stuff can help you push into business. It can help you push into other areas. It may help your business. It may be, I don't know, I just don't know what to do at the moment. Like we're in an age where you could talk about pretty much paint drying on a wall and people will sit and watch that. My, I remember my son, he used to watch the washing machine going around on YouTube. He would find that and just sit there and watch it. it had a massive following. It's crazy. Uh, you know, what people will watch. So don't think that your message isn't exciting enough or anyone isn't going to listen to it. You, you've got something there. And now with Facebook Live, which is, you know, why I've encouraged my staff to do that because of their future, the brand of them that they represent, not just with the business that, you know, that they work for me, it's their own personal brand. So that's why I encourage it because they've all got a great message that they can share out with the world. Now, what I hear a lot, and I'm, I'm trying to do a bit more interviews with people that are in local business to kind of, you know, I think, you know what, I like this one. Um, let, let's share it and let, let's, let's put them out there, get people to know about it because I'm all up for helping small businesses, that kind of thing. Everyone goes a little bit freaky and a little bit nervous about it. Oh, I don't want to talk on live camera. They're okay talking to people one-to-one, -one, but basically I'm just holding the phone. I'm looking at myself, and I'm talking to you guys. Whoever's watching it is whoever's watching it. And it's, sometimes you just got to keep that, those little things simple. Uh, I don't know enough yet. Don't worry about it. You know what? So people will watch it anyway. If you, like, I've already made, stumbled a couple of times on this video, so it's okay. No one really cares. You know, no one's like sat there laughing. And if they do, I go, yeah, I know. My, I, my voice is gone or my teeth fell out. You just, it, it's okay. No one really gives a two hoots about it. But we worry so much about that. So I'm going to give you some top tips. Uh, and it's to start putting your brand out there and just mimic what I've done. You could call it the same thing. It doesn't matter. Go with the same thing. Mindset explosion. Who cares? Like, did the BBC's... Uh, ITV, did they say, well, you can't call it the news because we're calling it the news. No, just put the message out there. If I inspire one person, if I have one viewer and that one person went out and sent out a message uh, or, and that then helped 10,000, awesome. But that's all I, that, that's kind of what I want to do. It And put your best stuff out. Don't hold in, if you've got a, a gift or something that you're good at, don't hold it back and wait for people to, you know, you go wait for the money. Don't get the, don't even think about that. Just put your best stuff out for free and then see what happens and let that grow out there. So here's some top tips using Facebook Live that I've uh, been given and it's basically do what I'm doing. It's simple as that. 
Start your episodes. Don't worry about talking. The first one, you're probably going to stumble anyway. But it's like your building block. And if you've got stuff you would need to research and talk about, um, like um, Donna works for me, so she's doing a, a nutrition course. I'm so pleased she just launched herself straight into it without finishing the course. Because good, because then she's going to learn by talking about it. She doesn't need to know all that information. And on the way, she's practicing actually talking on camera like this, on a, holding a phone. And that's what you need. You don't even need a, a film crew. We, you know, we're in a day an age where you can hold out the phone in front of you that's it that's all you need it could be iphone whatever I'll get someone to hold it for you so start an episode start doing episodes if you haven't got a name of a show who cares you'll find it on the way and your personal brand may evolve as you start and it will come over time and maybe you'll get if you're not happy in a job best thing to start doing is now because at least then you might get noticed for other things people will start to see that and it may be you, you know you may get called up to do talks and stuff. since I've done these videos and now people are asking to come oh we do a talk here and yeah I'd love to I, I can't wait to do those things then like a social media one I'd love to do these things because I love giving this stuff out I you know I'm seeing people how it helps other people so that's that's just my personal brand and it's evolving all the time since I've started doing these things so get it out there start an episode and episode one it, you know is episode one but imagine when someone catches up on episode 52 and they, oh my gosh they see it for the first time they're gonna look back and you know they're gonna think wow now you may see when you're watching my videos that my staff are going hearts 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 so that's just to help push it up and if you know up on the news feed there we go <laughs> and now everyone's doing it which is even better because you're loving it so cool thank you and it just pushes up more up on the news feed especially if you get that in the beginning you've also seen me asking people to share it and it's just because I, you know i hope this message gets out to someone and inspires someone to do maybe something like this of any age and any um educational level because you don't need to have you know the brain on you you just got something that you want to share and talk about so start putting it out there see what happens you talk about i don't know i'm trying to look out the window for an idea but i see a plastic chair you could talk about plastic chairs well you know what if that was your show then people would watch and you get a following and you know maybe b and q will sponsor you for their summer plastic chairs, whatever, out, outdoor furniture. You can talk about anything. If people, I watch, my children watch um, the, the Minecraft Stampy and they sit watching to, you know, this, um, this guy playing and creating Minecraft videos and I, they love it. So he's, he's, got, he's got a massive following just from doing something he loved. That's the age that we're in. But maybe we were disciplined and educated in a, a different way. You know, when we were growing up, oh, you must do this, you must do that, you must follow this one. All right? So don't be afraid. Hi, Ari. <laughs> Great. Okay. Now, if you would like me to give you some Facebook live training, I'm all up for that. And if you are up for that, drop some, like, camera emojis in for me so that I know that's something that's, you know, people may be interested in. And I'll sit down with you and, you know, we'll work out some different ideas. Uh, I'm mentoring Sophie Benson at the moment for Sophisticare, um, <clears throat> sorry, first day training. And same thing, Sophie was nervous. And I think you're still watching Sophie. Tell them how nervous you were. But you've done it, you've gone out, and it's just going to grow and grow and grow and grow from there. And the same for my staff. They were all very nervous about that. So it's, it's grown, it's grown, it's grown, it's, it's grown from there. So just keep going with that. You know, if you want the, the help, I will, but just start, and it will happen. And that's a great way to get noticed, but give out a great message from there. I hope this has helped. And, you know, obviously, when I, and my tips, you know, when I'm asking you to put the emojis in, it's just to help engagement. It helps Facebook notice it a little bit more so that message can go out. So that, and, you know, of course, I'm going to comment back because I'm grateful for people sh uh, sharing it and grateful that you've commented on there. And it, it's, that, that's it. That's all you have to do. And then, of course, get your message out. When I do the, um, like the Monday one, a little bit of a competition, because I want you guys to tune in and be excited for it, but mostly because I hope you're getting content. Not that I need hearts, not that I need likes, not that I need followers. I just hope that one person gets something from this, inspires them to go and do something else, and of course, if there's more, then great. But if one of you goes out and does the same thing, you're now going to inspire someone else. And, and that's, like, me is giving with a given hand, and that's the gift of giving. I hope you've got something from this, so please put in hashtag uh, mindset explosion. And if you're up for some uh, Facebook live training or branding, this, the stuff that we're doing, that we're still finding our way. Don't, don't think I'm the Mr. Entrepreneur. I'm not. I'm, I'm training for that, of course, but it's because I want to you know, do something 
worthwhile that puts back and all these skill sets I've had to learn to grow a, a martial arts business which is like a small niche within a niche it's not easy so I know I can help with um, you know this this sort of thing all right guys have a great day if you're watching the races have fun don't bet too much money and if you're at the races don't just have fun just have fun I'm not gonna say don't do anything <laughs> all right guys peace